Hey guys, this is Rock back with another video. <clears throat> I am at the Bossier Mall in front of everyone doing a video, and I could care less who's watching. Uh, it's been on my heart a couple of days ago to do this video, uh, but I had another one in between, so I, I didn't get a chance to. But it's really quick. I want to mention the story about the Ark in the Bible. I thought about something recently that I, I went through. Um, I actually was opening another store and I was going through something that for a time period kind of held me back and it blocked my, my goals for that new store. And even though uh, when my new store was setting vacant, I couldn't decide what I wanted to do with my life at the time and uh, had no intentions or no desire to even have the building, but God put it on my heart to keep the building. And didn't explain why or what or anything like that. Uh, I was just, my first instinct was to keep it. Didn't ask questions. A couple months went by. And here we are moving into the building. Um, you know, I'm not going to ask. He might, for all I know, you know, I could, everything else I've ever had could go away and this building could be what keeps our, uh, our life afloat. So the proverbial ark, it reminds me of the situation where Noah was spoke to by God and he just said, you know, trust me and, and build this ark and don't ask questions. And so I'd like to relate this really short video to that. Uh, in Proverbs 3, 5 and 6, trust not in thine own understanding, but trust in the Lord. And so that's what I did. Didn't ask questions, didn't need another store, just did what I felt like he wanted me to do. That's the point. When you get that voice, that little voice in your shoulder, the one that you barely hear, that small one, listen to it. It could be the voice that saves your life. Remember, I love you, God loves you. Peace, guys. Until next time, click on subscribe.